morning you guys happy friday so today there is a lot that needs to be done i'm hoping and praying for a really productive day because i have so many things i need to do today so this week we started our first week of block seven so this was our first week back from christmas break and block seven for us is hematology oncology and psychiatry so this week we were just basically learning the basics of hematology and um we had a bunch of cell bio lectures we have our first cell biology test on Tuesday. We also had some pathology SDLs that I am so behind on so the goal today is to catch up on pathology SDLs and study for my cell bio test. We are also going to pick up a puppy tomorrow. I still can't believe that but yeah we're picking up a puppy tomorrow so I absolutely have nothing for the puppy right now. I have to go pick up some things for him. That's the plan for the day. I have to have all this stuff done before like 4 p.m. Yeah, a lot needs to be done. It's 7 a.m. right now. I think I'm gonna start with pathology just because I'm so behind on it. Uh, so we're gonna start with that and then go from there. Okay. of everything that I have so I got this bed for him I really wanted something that would like match my decor in here so I didn't find anything at home goods home goods didn't have anything that like really matched in here I thought about getting that black fuzzy one but that wasn't it so this one I think it looks really good with my couch and it'll also look good if I want to put it in my office upstairs it'll match that because it's pretty neutral so I hope it loves it. So I got that from Target. And then also from Target, I got this toy. It makes noise. Oh, it squeaks too. I didn't know that. And then it has like ropes and stuff on it. So if you wanted to play tug of war. <laughs> I just thought this was cute. So I got this for him. And then... We got the food bowl and the drinking bowl. So I got this one for the water and then this one for the food. And I think they look really cute together. I don't know where I'm gonna put them yet, but we'll figure that out. And then also for Target, I got some treats. I got the milk bone mini ones. I don't really know anything about treats, but this seemed appropriate. So that's what I got. Yeah. Okay, moving on. Um, from Home Goods, I got this. This is a anxiety solution snuggle puppy. The woman at the store when I was checking out, she said these really work. They come with like this little heartbeat thing you put inside of the um, stuffed animal. 
like that and it's supposed to it pulses like a real heartbeat so it's supposed to help like calm their anxiety and stuff so i'm gonna put this i plan on crate training him so um i plan on using this when i put him in the crate so he doesn't feel lonely so i got that from home goods and then oh i i got these i don't know i think i got these from target i think yeah from target just the doggy training pads while i'm potty training them and finally i got him this teething toy so you can like put water on it and then freeze it and it'll help soothe his teeth for when he starts teething and i also got dog food let me show you and this is the dog food that i got this is the food that the breeder has been giving him so i texted the breeder this morning and i was like please send me a picture of the food that you've been giving him because i wanted to give him the same kind of food so that nothing upset his stomach or anything so yeah that's that's what we got i'm excited oh my crate the crate that i'm getting for him my sister has an extra crate so i'm gonna pick that up before i go pick up the dog tomorrow and um, then we'll be all set the only thing that i didn't get is a leash and either a collar or a harness i really want a harness for him i didn't really want to get a collar so i was looking everywhere for a harness that i liked but i didn't have any that i liked so i might just have to order one off amazon but other than that we are already we're set for him i've never really trained a dog before my biggest concern i think is him not wanting to sleep through the night which I guess the first couple of nights that he might not sleep through them because just it's a new environment. But I really want to crate train him to where he is like comfortable with his crate and his crate is like his own little space. Because my the last dog that we had, my family dog, the crate was like torture for her. Like it was a punishment. I don't want that for him. I want it to be like a space for him to go in and feel comfortable with. Because like when I have to leave for class or something, I don't want him to feel like it's we're torturing him and putting him in the crate. So I'm gonna crate train him to hopefully enjoy and love his crate and we'll see how, if it works out. We will see, we've got everything that we need. Now we just need the dog. <laughs> I didn't end up making it through all of my pathology STLs just because I kind of get tired of reading those. So I stopped after the third one and then I started studying for cell bio since I have a test on that on Monday. can carry my duty tomorrow i need you to get i need you to get the behind the scenes i need i need footage can you do that 